Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Becky, I'm a pelvic floor physical therapist here to help you understand more about your pelvic health. Today we're gonna to talk about what may seem like an obvious topic, but you will be surprised that you are probably wrong. We're going to talk about what does the large intestine actually do? So let's shed some light on what's going on down there. All right, this is gonna be a two second video. Your large intestine makes you poop. See you later. That's only the small part of what your large intestine does. I mean, the poor thing, it gets such a bad rap. If all people thought about you was that you just like made crap, you probably wouldn't feel really good about yourself, right? <laughs> its actual job is to reabsorb water. If you didn't have your large intestine, you wouldn't last very long. Think about if you've ever had diarrhea, not the most fun thing, it's super watery. And that's because whatever was bothering your guts just rushed right through you. And it just, Pasco didn't collect $200 and it went straight to the toilet. So that tells you, okay, well, what does a large intestine do? It actually sucks water back in. A rough estimate is that for every 16 ounces or two cups of water that enters the colon, only five ounces or like half a cup exits when you poop. So 75% of the water that enters the colon gets reabsorbed. That is no small amount. Why does this job matter? Think about a couple different examples. Um, if you're exercising, your body is pulling more water and nutrients towards your muscles. And so if you aren't reabsorbing that water by your colon, you're not gonna have the energy that you need to help your muscles perform. And then like we said before, diarrhea, if you are just constantly eliminating what's inside your large intestine and aren't replacing it with fluids, it can lead to serious consequences and you could even die from it. Remember the gut needs water to help you be healthy. It helps with cleaning you out, you know, helping get rid of all that bacteria, helping lubricate your poop. You need water to do that and helping get those nutrients reabsorbed too that, that get um, pulled in along with the water. So what can you do to help? No, it's probably kind of obvious, right? But drink more water. Most of us don't get enough of it anyways. Let me know what questions you have in the comments down below. I know it's kind of an interesting topic, happy to share more about all this kind of stuff. You just let me know what you want to hear about. Thanks for coming. See you next time.